the future is all about autonomous vehicles, driverless cars. In order to get into complete driverless, we need to give uh, the capability to the cars, to the vehicles, to perform various connectivity operations, analyze a lot of data, and transmit the data and communicate with the external world. We are demonstrating uh, Toby L4 solution. It's an LT CAT6 smart modem. It's essentially a telematic box. It gives the connectivity to the cars or any, any vehicles, uh, allowing them to perform various connective operations. It's a very powerful processor in the market. It has quad core and it's running Linux as well, allowing you to uh, run your embedded application. We have a Toby L4, we have Ella, a Wi-Fi module in there, and we also have Neo, our GPS module in there. So all between all the three, that's all connectivity uh, that is given to the telematic box. We connect the uh, USB connector to the control PC and from there we can control the overall telematic box and we can also build our application on the laptop and then run and drive uh, the telematic box from there. What I have here is an application which allows the wireless car to be operated from remotely. For example, this is a car which could be parked in your house in your office, you can still control it while you are very far from it. You can see the fuel consumption, you can see the distance, you can pretty much drive the car remotely. Uh, if I wanted to, I can try to honk the car. And you can see the car has honked. Um, and I'm doing that over uh, the LT connectivity. I'll, I'll lock the car now. You can, uh, it probably takes a pin, give any pin you want. We uh, get the data from the application to the modem and get the data through the internet into the LT outside. Then you get the data back as well. So we have got a complete loop back of the data using the LT gateway module. The slim version of our Toby L4, what you can do is you can add an external application processor and you can build your application on that as well. But it's entirely up to individual users whether they want to use the smart modem or the slim modem. A connected car is basically a smartphone. A car is behaving like a smartphone. The smartphone is always connected. All the apps are connected, everything else is connected. Exactly in the same way, the car is also connected. Mm -hmm.